both men and women can get an HIV infection. Symptoms of HIV can vary between individuals, however the first signs of infection generally appear within the first one to two months. No two men with HIV will likely experience the exact same symptoms. What is HIV? HIV is a virus that affects the immune system, specifically the CD4 cells. The CD4 cells help protect the body from illness. Unlike other viruses that the immune system can normally fight off, HIV cannot be eliminated by the immune system. More than two-thirds of all new HIV cases occur in men. There are varying symptoms of HIV in men depending upon the stage of the disease they are in, first, acute HIV stage, second, asymptomatic stage, third, advanced stage known as AIDS. As a man, you may experience the following symptoms during the early stage of the HIV infection. Fever, usually one of the first symptoms of HIV, is often accompanied by other mild symptoms, such as fatigue swollen lymph glands, and a sore throat. At this point, the virus is moving into the bloodstream, and starting to replicate in large numbers. As that happens, your immune system induces an inflammatory reaction. Lymph nodes are part of your body's immune system, and protect your blood, by getting rid of bacteria and viruses. They tend to get inflamed when there's an infection. Many of them are located in your armpit, groin, and neck which can result in aches and pains in these areas. Fatigue and headache are reported as common symptoms related to HIV. Half of all people with HIV or AIDS are affected by a headache, most of them severely, a new study shows. Researchers at the University of Mississippi assessed 200 patients with HIV AIDS and found that 53.5% reported a headache. More than 85% of those people met the criteria for a migraine and 27.5% met the criteria for a chronic migraine, a rare condition that causes migraine symptoms 15 or more days per month. Nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea Many people experience digestive system problems as a symptom of the early stages of HIV. However, nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea can also appear in later stages of infection, usually as the result of an opportunistic infection. Many people will get night sweats during the early stages of HIV. These can be even more common later in infection and are not related to exercise or the temperature of the room. When your body's immune system is weakened by HIV, infections can develop. These infections may lead to skin conditions such as rashes, sores, and lesions. Skin conditions can be among the earliest signs of the presence of HIV in your body. They are often viewed as indicators of HIV's progression. A severe, sore throat and dry cough that can last for weeks to months without seeming to resolve, even with antibiotics and inhalers, are typical symptoms in very ill HIV patients. With such a vast array of symptoms, HIV testing is vital to ensure a proper diagnosis. If you think you've been exposed to HIV, or have an active sex life with casual sex partners, regardless of whether you are showing symptoms of HIV or not, it's important to get tested as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. For more information, visit our website www.hivrnatestguide.com.